hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're stopping by for the first time you're definitely welcome this is Sintiben makeover a nigerian makeup artist based in Owewe. so if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please subscribe to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm going to be showing you how i glammed my girl up for her induction though this tutorial is gonna be very short i hope you enjoy it so i already cleaned her face right now i'm using cetaphil face moisturizer to moisturize her face so next i used my mic of magnesium to prime her face to foundation i used sickle foundation in the shade 015 so i'm just using this beauty sponge to blend in the foundation so right now the foundation is well blended i'm going to be contouring i'm using zico foundation in the shade 030 to contour her face so next i'm using my champion creation cream blush to blush her cheeks So moving on to highlight, I'm using my Avo concealer in the shade 830 to highlight the outer corner of her face. So I went ahead using the same Avo concealer in the shade 820 to highlight the inner corner of her face. So next, I went with my beauty sponge to blend in the concealer on the highlighted area. So right now I'm setting her face. I'm using Mira Cosmetics Setting Powder in the shade Cinnamon to set her face. So I'm done using my beauty sponge to set her face. Right now I'm using my small blending brush to set properly. I'm using the same brush to dust out the SS setting powder on her face. So next is to powder her face. I'm using my Adventure Powder Palette. I'm using her shade to powder the whole of her face using my powder blending brush. So moving on to contour, I used the same powder palette. I used the two shades I just showed you guys to contour her face. So next, I used the same powder palette. I used this shade here to contour her nose. So I went back using my powder brush to blend in properly. Then next is to set her face. I'm using my Kiss Beauty Fix Spray to set her face. So I let the face dry a little right now. I'm baking. I will also do reverse contour. to her brows i'm using my spoolie brush to brush her brows first then i went with my brow tan this helps to lay the hair nicely so next i'm using my angled brush with my carrot gel liner to outline her brows
so i went back using my eyeshadow blending brush i went back blending the lid very well so it would look neat and well blended <laughs> So moving on to the next eyeshadow, I'm using my Morphe eyeshadow palette. I'm using the shade there to apply on her lid. So next, I added some pigment on her lid. I'm using MK Pigment, the golden color. So I'm just using my finger to place it on her lid. So next, I use my brush to apply another pigment on the outer corner of her lid. So I'm just using my brush to press it in. So moving on to eyeliner, I'm using my carrot gel liner, the black one. I'm using my angled brush to line her lid. So for her waterline, I'm using the same gel liner on her waterline. So next, I'm using my Zaron mascara to darken her natural lashes. So moving on to eyelashes, I'm using lashes. So next, I used my small blending brush to dust out the excess powder underneath her eyes. So I went back using my powder brush to blend again. So moving on to blush, I'm using my House of Tara blush palette to blush her cheeks. So I went back using my powder brush to blend again. So right now everything is well blended. I'm going to be setting her face using my Kiss Beauty Fix Spray. So I let her face dry. I'm going to be highlighting her face using my Yanga Beauty Glow Dust. using my nose contour brush to snatch her nose again so for her lower lashes i'm using my zaron mascara on her lower lashes <laughs> So moving on to her lip, I'm using my Blossom Lip Palette. I'm using this wine color to line her lip. So I added this peach color from the same lip palette. I'm just going to use my lip blending brush to blend everything together. back using my powder brush to blend her face again so i went back using my small powder blending brush to blend the areas underneath her eyes
So next, I'm just going to spray her face again for the last time using my Kiss Beauty Fix Spray. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I didn't do much video due to time. She was already running late. And I let the face dry a little before I added some TM Essential Cheek Glaze just to make her cheeks glow. Um, Yeah that's the final look i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please like my video comment share turn on your post notification button and i will see you all in my next video bye guys